Hi, I'm Dr. Kelly Brogan and I'm here to talk to you about the birth control pill. So despite having taken it myself for 12 years, I've come to believe that it represents a significant obstacle to mental health and appropriate hormone balance. And when I talk about the interplay between adrenal, thyroid, and sex hormones, I use the analogy of 3D glasses so that if you were to cover up one of the lenses, you just can't expect the picture to be quite right. So these days when I meet a patient who complains about flat mood, low libido, weight gain, irritability, depression, and anxiety, one of the first questions that I ask is, are you on the pill? And it appears that there is a subset of patients for whom synthetic hormones are a really bad fit and can exacerbate either pre-existing psychiatric symptoms or manifest new psychiatric symptoms. And there are a couple of plausible mechanisms that explain why this might be happening. The first is that synthetic hormones like those in birth control pills raise things called thyroid and sex hormone binding globulins, which effectively lower the free hormones available to do the very important work that they do. And this might explain why uh, people who take birth control often complain of things like weight gain, low libido, and sort of a general flatness. These pills can also interfere with antioxidant and inflammatory uh, markers, such as something called CRP, and have also been shown to diminish important minerals and vitamins like selenium, magnesium, zinc, vitamin C, and then B vitamins like B6 and folate. And because of what we're learning about genetic variants that can interfere with folate metabolism in some women, particularly in women uh, who are prone to develop depression, anxiety, and other mental illnesses, this can be a very significant uh, interference, and particularly one that may negatively impact a future pregnancy. So what are the options? If you're using birth control for hormonal balance because you have PMS or even something called PMDD, which is a more severe um, mental health variant of PMS, then there is a better way through functional medicine and personalized testing to balance your hormones naturally. And if you're using it for contraception, then of course there's the old condom. Uh, and there's also a non-hormonal IUD called Paragard. And then there are a number of um, basal body temperature tracking devices like one called the Pearly, which is a British gadget that you can order online. So hopefully this has been somewhat helpful in illuminating some of my concerns and introducing you to a different way to think about birth control. Thank you.